Hey folks, Michael Rosso here, Film Photography Project. Shooting today's movie is John Fidelli. Double perforated film versus single perforated film. What's the difference? What do you need to know? Well, 16 millimeter film was invented by Eastman Kodak, originally for people, so they could shoot home movies in a very small, compact camera at home, home movies. Original home movies were 16 millimeter. It was double perforated, a perf on each side. The perf is the hole, of course. Today, in 2022 and beyond, the standard in 16 millimeter film is single perforated film. Well, a lot of the older cameras, like the Keystone A7 and many other vintage cameras only take double perforated film. So if you're looking for a 16 millimeter camera on eBay, what do you need to look for to know what type of 16 millimeter film you need? Well, I'm gonna show you. And sometimes you may have to ask the seller at an auction to actually send you some additional pictures. So if a camera takes double perforated film, you will know because when you're loading it, do you see that? Do you see that oh, gear? Yeah. See, there's these um, nubs. Yes, there's these nubs. You load your film through here and your film has to go on each nub. So you cannot load single perforated film in a camera that's designed for double perforated film. Here's the Keystone A12. Now this one is the Criterion Deluxe A12. Oh. This takes single perforated film. Only one set of nubs. This side's clean. Yeah. It gets confusing because the A12, the Keystone A12, you could see it on eBay and be like, oh my God, I'm gonna buy the A12 and I could use modern day single perf films. There's a lot more single perf films available than there are double perf. So if it says A12, you may wanna ask the seller because unless it's a Criterion Deluxe, mm. it's gonna take double perforated film. So what does that mean for you? And what are we gonna do about it? Well, the Film Photography Project Project was to bring back a wide array of double perforated film so you can go to eBay and buy these really inexpensive cameras and shoot beautiful, crisp 16 millimeter film. In the description below is a link to our blog written by Owen McCafferty that gives you more details about single perf versus double perf. Comments, leave them down below. Email podcast at filmphotographyproject.com. Here to help. If you're buying something, ask the seller. Yours, by the way, the seller won't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so just ask for detailed pictures. And there you have it. We'll see you next time.